The Emir of Zazzao, Ambassador Amanu Bamali, who delivered his message through the Gurkwan Ayukan Zazzao, Balarba Musa, at the function in Kaduna said, The scourge of drug abuse is a menace that need to be addressed. All what the Emir wants, let us have a tactical approach of whatever we have with regard to insecurity, and we don't need anything violent. And also, secondly, they said that we should keep on praying because there are some things that exceeded your power and is above the, your limit. What you can engage yourself only is to pray. If we pray, God can, is ready to answer our prayers whenever, anyhow, anytime. Insecurity has cast a shadow over our communities, hindering progress and diminishing the quality of life for many. Today, I call upon the youth to be the church bearers of peace, unity, and security. The National President Radio, Television, Theatre and Act Workers Union Ratao, Dr. Kabir Sani, and a security expert, the Executive Director, Beacon Consultant, Dr. Kabir Adamu, urge the youth to be vigilant and be active participant in community policing. Just let us try and overcome the challenges we're having of insecurity. This is what matters most in Nigeria. Not only in northern Nigeria, as people are claiming, are claim, no. It affects every nook and currency of Nigeria. So that we have to support those who are willing to change the narrative, which is, is necessary. So uh, we can see in this drug abuse, primary response to some of the security challenges. The challenges for them are what we feel like we have done. The old people have done their own part. I think the old people have to understand what they do. Also, the issue of drugs and other things. There are some people that are benefited from the lack of uh, uh, good focus on Nigeria. 76% of the causes of insecurity in northern Nigeria is as a result of drug abuse. Even though poverty, illiteracy is part of it. But that we believe that abusing drugs, people are consuming substances that they don't even know what they are. And that directly or indirectly affects their mindset and make them to go violently into committing one crime or the other. Other speakers say illiteracy is a barrier that restricts individuals and society from reaching their full potentials. Yusuf Kudan, AIT News, Kaduna.